Mercedes Benz. Okay, well, I, I couldn't get the Mercedes Benz, so and you got then, that. This is all you gave me for my sweet 16 and my golden. Girl, do you know how much money that is? That's $1,600 for That's 16. That's for my sweet 16 and my golden birthday? If there's one thing I can't stand in this world, it is ungrateful, entitled, spoiled brats. And today we're going to be taking a look at a video that went viral recently that left me absolutely speechless. But before we get into it, I want you guys to go back and think about what you got for your 16th birthday. Maybe you got a new game, some cash some clothes, or some of you might have even been lucky enough to get a car. But the real question is, did any of you get a Tesla? I didn't. If I remember, I'm pretty sure I got some shoes or something. But if I did get a Tesla or any car at all, I would have been possibly the happiest and most grateful 16-year-old on the planet. I think most would, but not this daughter. This is a daughter who got a brand new Tesla for her sweet 16 and $1,600 on top of that. But instead of being happy and ecstatic in that moment, she's instead annoyed, sad, and angry that she didn't get the other car she wanted. This is baffling. Hey, you guys. So, I just got home. My daughter's sweet 16 birthday. So, I just surprised her with her new car. I hope she's going to be very excited. Um, I just made it home. So, I'm about to go inside the house. And... Surprise her with her car. Let's see how this go. I know she's gonna be so excited. So let's go get her, you guys. We taking you. Oh my god! Hold on, it's the door. All right. So step, step. Okay. Hold her hand. You gonna hold her hand for it? Come over here. It's raining, I know. Come on. Oh my god. So she's going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Okay, take your mask off. Surprise! This is your car, girl. I didn't want to Tesla. I don't want I don't like electric cars. Wait, what? For Mercedes Benz. I don't like Tesla. You like, you said you like the electric cars. I never cars. said I like Tesla. I said a Mercedes Benz. I don't like Tesla. Well, you gotta like, this is better than a Mercedes Benz. This is not. But I don't want no car that, if I gotta, I gotta charge it for it to work. I didn't want that. This is where this video should have ended. If I was this parent, this car would have been returned to the dealership right then and there. e fucking immediately. Not only would you not be getting a Mercedes Benz, but any gift at all would be out of the question. You're gonna be walking indefinitely after this. You'd also be disowned on the spot. <laughs> All right, maybe that's a little too far, but I mean, this is wild. This person is pretty much the very definition of privileged and entitled. I don't think I'll ever understand parents who get their kids brand new expensive cars for their birthday. At an age where you're supposed to be getting your first job, learning the value of money, and actually earning something yourself, the last thing you need is a brand new car, let alone a Tesla. Now, I don't think it's a shot in the dark to assume that this daughter has probably Probably never worked a day in her life and most likely won't be working for years to come. But anyways, unfortunately, this isn't where the video ends and it only gets sadder from here. Brace yourselves. I don't want no car that if I gotta, I gotta charge it for it to work. I didn't want that. Girl, you need to be grateful that you got a damn car. I could have, I could have just been walking it. I would rather walk it in. Get the car. Right, you, you should be happy. Be grateful. You can put your Put the keys back in your purse. Oh, and I will. And don't and ask me for nothing this. else. Oh, you're going to be happy with that money. How much is this? Girl, open it up and stop being ungrateful. Because now you're starting to be ungrateful. Where you ain't got to no, worry about me I ever again. I never said I wanted a Tesla. You, I always told you I wanted a pink Mercedes Benz. Okay, well, I, didn't, I couldn't get the Mercedes Benz. So and you got that. This is all you gave me for my sweet 16 and my golden... Girl, do you know how much money that is? That's $1,600 for That's 16... That's it for my sweet 16 and my golden birthday? Well, what did you want? And then you gave me the truck. I do this is the car. It's not the truck. This is the car one. You guys, look. You can have all your gifts back because 
Why would you do this? This is my sweet 16 and my golden birthday. And you gave me a car I didn't even want. And then you gave me little money. At this point, the person behind the camera is just documenting their failure as a parent. Like, how does someone even get to this level? How bad does the parenting have to be for your kid to be rejecting Teslas, let alone any car, as well as $1,600 for their 16th birthday? That is insane. But yeah, this is pretty much the product of being coddled and never being told no for your entire life. You end up with spoiled brats where pretty much nothing will ever be enough to satisfy their wants, even brand new Teslas. But yeah, the more I watch this video, the more I realize how good of a condom ad it would be. I had a good video just in general to watch for new parents to teach you how to not raise your child. Seriously, if anyone knows any new or soon-to-be parents, show them this video. $1,600 for, for my sweet 16 and my golden birthday? But yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if we're witnessing a future Karen in training right here. She is without a doubt going to be a future Karen boss battle come 20 years. Car I didn't even want and then you gave me little money. You was being really, really ungrateful. You can give this to your mom. Yay! <laughs> this is ridiculous. Deja, get back over here and I'm not playing. It's a gift. I don't oh, here you go. Here you go. So you really don't want this Tesla? Electric cars, I don't want to have to charge my car to get on it. You could have kept your gifts okay, and all that. I'll take it back while I give it to somebody that wanted it. Like, I did not ask for it. Is you serious? Worst birthday ever. Like, ugh. how was this your worst birthday? Because I didn't ask for Did she just? You guys, I am so sorry, and honestly, I'm embarrassed. Worst birthday ever. How was this your worst birthday? Imagine being so entitled that getting a Tesla and $1,600 is considered the worst birthday ever. I think that would be the best day ever for most people if they got that as a gift. Hell, if the mom is watching this video, send the Tesla right on over to me. I'll happily take it off your hands. I'd be very grateful for a gift like that. Now, I already know what some of you might be thinking since I'm actually a mind reader. I could read your mind through the screen. You might be thinking that this has to be fake, possibly staged, and honestly, I did too. But then I did some more research and found out there was a follow-up video, and holy shit, I don't know if this is fake. Okay, so we at the Mercedes Ben um, car dealership with this Ford Brat. I'm trying to see if they'll take this Tesla. Um, back since she didn't want it and I felt kind of bad. I felt like I ruined her birthday. So we're about to um, look for a car. Let's go get the salesman. You guys, we finally found, I finally found her a car. <laughs> she happy now. So we're gonna okay, get this one. Giving me some money then? No, you, look, you, burnt, you burnt that. When <laughs> you told me that wasn't a lot of money, no, I'm not doing that. So you gonna get the car and that's it. So I'm not getting the money anymore? Nope. Who is cold? This is gonna be her sweet 16 birthday oh, present. Who is cold? Well, we can walk back inside. Okay. okay. So she can get this painted pink, right? So it looks like at the end of the day, no lessons have been learned, and the spoiled brat has won, unsurprisingly. I mean, did you really expect any other outcome? Come on. At the end of the day, the whole reason people are the way they are is because of their parents. I finally found her a car. <laughs> she happy now. If I had to bet, this has most likely been a reoccurring theme for this daughter's whole life, and is probably only going to continue later on. With that said, I pray on the off chance that this video might be staged, but honestly, 
honestly, there are definitely people out there that are exactly like this. Parents that are like this. You said you like the electric cars. I said I like Tesla. I said a Mercedes Benz. I don't like Tesla. What? This video really isn't all that far-fetched at all in my eyes. And I think that most people know at least one person they've met in their life that have acted in a similar way. I guess in the end, the lesson to be learned is to not spoil your kids, raise them well, and just be thankful. But anyways, I think that's gonna wrap up today's video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for some more juicy videos coming soon to the channel. And until then, stay grateful. Peace.